right so out of 67 premier institutions the world over nowhere is mcq the norm for admissions definitely not for phd uh, and even if you know there are some mcqs these are not exclusive so you may have uh, you know part of the exam which is a, a, a mcq but rest is subjective here in the nta and the cuet whether for undergrad for postgrad phd you already saw that there is no phd exam happening at all uh, none of them have a pattern other than mcq and that is a, a deeply disturbing fact as you will see from different perspectives why is that uh, a problem uh, even for screening purposes, because that's one argument which is normally given, but uh, uh, the results, I mean, discussions that have happened earlier shows that even for screening purposes, it's not fair. So, you know, you have option A and option B, part A and part B, part A when you qualify, you do the part B. Uh, the survey uh, and, and uh, you know, uh, looking at the data shows that those who have qualified in part A need not necessarily also qualify in part b and vice versa so obviously it's not a screening method which is fair uh, and hence even for screening purposes it's a difficult uh, thing to do it's an unfair thing to do we'll go into the specifics of the problems that the mcq pattern of uh, exams have particularly uh, in the case of social sciences and sciences and other issues that come uh, from that so i'll this is just to show you what the reality currently is. The usual semester in JNU used to be of 18 weeks, both the semesters, the monsoon and, uh, and the details are July 23rd to December 5th. Uh, this is how the semester used to be, which was called the monsoon semester. And the winter semester again of 18 weeks, starting with Jan 5th to May 18th. With what has happened and what is tentatively going to happen because of the QET is that both these semesters are going to be truncated because we have not had admissions as yet. So one semester is gone. Everything is no, going to be clubbed into those three semesters. Four semesters have to be taught within that. And in all likelihood, the semesters would be of 10, 10 or maximum 12 weeks. And as a result, the second semester would, would be even shorter. We have had this experience, so this is not exaggerated. There is a semester going on which is only of six, six weeks. So just imagine 18 versus six. So six weeks is what we have taught uh, in, uh, in at least one of the schools which uh, I would request Madhu to speak about.